Hello there boys and girls, welcome to Scottish Geeks. Uh, it's time for a little bit of an update about what's actually happening on the channel. I do these from time to time just so you guys can sort of get an idea of what's going through my head. Sort of, you don't really don't want to know what's actually going through my head. Anyway, so, yes. Um, some of you might be wondering why I'm not doing as many horror videos as I used to do. Well, that is mainly because it has been slim pickings recently for horror games. The most recent one was Layers of Fear, but other than that, there really hasn't been anything out there that's been worth playing. I'm sure we will come back to that soon enough because I always do come back to horror. It is my favourite genre after all. Uh, some of you may or may not have been appreciating the fact that I'm trying a bit of diversity in the games I'm playing. I've been playing Yandere Simulator, Firewatch, Nekopara, a couple of new indie games, things like that. And uh, mainly I'm doing that because, I mean, we're fast approaching 8,000 subscribers soon. And I really want to broaden, you know, my horizons for what's actually happening with the channel. I want to be able to, you know, encompass as much as I possibly can while still entertaining you guys, you know. Um, I'm not going to play games that I don't enjoy, you know. I played that Emily wants to play and I got bored of it so fucking quickly. Uh, and I do apologise for people who actually like that game, but I didn't. I didn't like it. I thought it was generic and boring. Um, but yeah, so I'm, I'm trying to expand my audience by expanding my video repertoire. So if there's anything you know that you might like to see or you think people that you know might like to see, please do comment below and um, I'll see what I can do. I'm not made of money, remember? So, you know, nothing too expensive. I can't go and buy a 40, 50 pound game every 10, 10 minutes, you know? Um, but yeah, I'm just trying to diversify a little bit. I hope you guys don't mind. I hope you guys have been enjoying it as much as I've been enjoying making them. I've been tracking new editing styles and things like that. I've also expanded my repertoire and went onto Twitter and uh, actually started posting a lot more now there. So uh, to give you an example of how quickly that's grown, I went from 300 followers at the beginning of last week to 600 followers today. So that's pretty damn good and I'm quite proud of that. And uh, thank you all who have followed me on Twitter. If you've came from Twitter to watch this video, thank you very, very much for following me and thank you for sharing my videos. I really, really do appreciate it. It does help more than you know because, I mean, I can't share my videos with people I don't know. You can share videos with people that I don't know that you think might like my videos, etc, etc. Whatever! Anyway, um, next thing on the agenda is a new uh, thing I'm starting to use just now. It's called Tube Buddy. And uh, I was a little bit wary of it to begin with, but the guy who runs TubeBuddy actually came up to me and says, look, do you want to try this out? And I said, yes, yeah, sure. It is a free thing. You can pay for some optional extras and things like that if you can afford it. Uh, but the free pack of it is actually pretty damn good as it is. It can help you to um, search for tags that you might not have thought of before. You can rearrange your, your tags in your video. It'll, it'll also help you to, you know, uh, put a card template on so you can put cards through it every single one of your videos You can actually do your annotations templates and things like that things that YouTube should have But doesn't is actually available in TubeBuddy. I recommend giving it a try um, As there will be a link in the description below to as to where you can find that now trust me on this I've tried it out myself. There's nothing dodgy about it. It is actually a very very good thing to use You could probably have noticed from the fact that a lot of my videos have actually started going up and views recently and I pin that down not only to the fact of you know I'm trying new things but also to uh, TubeBuddy for helping me to get them into the right areas of YouTube so yeah definitely go and give TubeBuddy a good try um, I might do a, a full review of it in a week or two uh, once I've you know figured everything out there's a hell of a lot to, to try out on it uh, but you know you can use the basic package etc um, but there are a lot of a lot of funky options that you guys should give a go and okay next on the agenda is tomorrow night we are going to be on Nicholas Vince's chat show chattering with Nicholas Vince Nicholas Vince is a veteran horror actor some of you may know him better as the chatterer from Hellraiser hence the name chattering with Nicholas Vince he's also Kinski in Nightbreed uh, he's a novelist he actually writes comic books he's just an all-round fantastic guy he's never really played horror games and I'm going to be trying to convince them that uh, horror games are a viable part of the horror genre. That's going to be tomorrow night. So I'll put a link in the description to below to as to where you can go to that. If you want to join in with the conversation, you can also tweet questions. Uh, also, you know, everything, everything you need will be in the link below. Okay? Everything you need to know is in the link below. 
And um, finally, um, I'd just like to say, you know, we're so close to 8,000 subscribers and I've got you lot to thank for that and I, I really am so happy with that. And my 8,000 subscriber video is going to consist of um, a little tour of my setup here. I'm going to I'm gonna have to dust. I'm going to have to dust this place and clean this place up. My gosh, you guys are making me do housework. Um, but I might even do a shout out or two. I haven't decided yet, you know, because my issue with doing a shout out, honestly, is that the people who get the shout out are happy they got the shout out, but then you've got a whole bunch of other people that are disappointed that they didn't get the shout out, and it's like, blah, oh god, you know, talking about which PewDiePie had his shout out, and guess who didn't win, <laughs> I'm so upset, no, it just means you're going to have to work harder, that's all it is, you know. I'm just gonna have to work harder and get you guys to, you know, share my videos around a bit more. Um, you know, that'd be lovely. I would, I would really appreciate it if you shared my videos with your friends. You know, especially for friends who you think would enjoy my stuff. Um, but yeah, I really want to get bigger. That's that's that is the crux of it. I want to, I want to grow as a channel. I want to get more people coming in. I want to build up a massive community. You can't have me all to yourself. Got to share. Come on. Anyway, guys. Uh, so yeah, I don't know if I actually covered every single point I wanted to, but I'm reaching the point where I usually stop these vlogs anyway because I run out of music. Uh, <laughs> that's how that's how I build my vlogs. I work on how much music I've actually got. Anyway, guys, um, thank you again so much for watching. Thank you for being here. Thank you for subscribing to me and su staying subscribed if you have. And just thank you for everything. You just you guys are amazing, and I really appreciate everything you guys do for me as a channel and I, I appreciate everything you do for the channel as well and um i'll catch you on twitter i'll be on twitter for the next week well so yeah tweet me you know scottish geeks it's easy everything scottish geeks find me in scottish geeks and instagram as well whatever anyway thanks for watching i'll catch you next time but until then bye, -bye.